Hey boys and girls, this is a rookie read about science book, Spiders Are Not Insects, and it is by Alan Fowler. Spiders Are Not Insects by Alan Fowler. You can find spiders almost anywhere. Some spiders live in hot, humid rainforests. Others live in hot, dry deserts. They live in water and woods, trees and gardens, and in people's homes. And this is an important feature of a nonfiction text. It's a picture, and it's got a little label or caption underneath that says, House Spider and Tarantula. That house spider looks huge. I would not want that in my house. Not many animals have been around as long as spiders. Spiders are not insects. They belong to a group of animals called arachnids. Arachnids have eight legs. Insects only have six. And this is a spotted fishing spider. Arachnids do not have wings. Insects do. Spiders use hairs on their bodies to sense the world around them. So here's hairs on the spider's leg. And this is a jumping spider. Oof. <clears throat> Insects sense things with feelers called antenna that grow on their heads. This is a milkweed longhorn beetle. Some spiders are so tiny that you can hardly see them. This is a crab spider. He's very tiny, actually. And some are big enough to eat birds and mice. The biggest ones belong to a family of hairy spiders called tarantulas. Most spiders are poisonous, but only a few kinds are dangerous. Spider bites can hurt, so it's best not to touch them. Only two spiders in North America are very dangerous to people. The brown recluse spider, and this is the brown recluse spider, and the female black widow, female black widow. And you can tell it's a black widow because it has a red hourglass on the back. <clears throat> if you see a spider marked with a red hourglass, keep away from it. You don't want a black widow to bite you. Female spiders are usually more poisonous than males and bigger. Spiders can move quickly. Some baby spiders can travel through the air. They cling to silk threads that are blown by the wind. This is called ballooning. The silk comes from the spider's own bodies and all spiders produce silk. Many kinds of spiders use their silk to spin webs. Different kinds of spiders weave webs of different designs. This is a tunnel spider, and you can see that his web makes a tunnel. <clears throat> webs are sticky. An insect that lands on a spider web becomes trapped. Then the spider may swing on a thread of silk toward the insect, inject it with poison, and eat it. Sometimes spiders use their silk to wrap up a trapped insect to eat later, garden spider and grasshopper. Spiders that don't weave webs are called hunting spiders. They go out looking for their prey. Tarantulas are hunting spiders. So are jumping spiders, which attack insects by jumping on them. Some spiders even eat other spiders golden silk spider. This is a garden spider. Spiders are not easy to like, but spiders do help people by eating insects that are harmful to plants or those that carry disease. And words to know, arachnids, jumping spider, black widow spider, tarantula, spider webs. This has been a book called Spiders Are Not Insects.
I hope you enjoyed it.